This is a lava field on the island of Hawaii. It's also a classroom for geology and volcanology students at the University of Hawaii at Hilo, the only school in the United States with an active volcano in its backyard. On this day, an undergraduate volcanology class hiked through a lava field where the towns of Kalapana and Kaimu once stood to reach an active lava flow, a two and a half mile trek under a blazing sun over difficult terrain. And a lot of people don't get an idea of how intense hiking on the lava or how vast and expansive it really is. And it's definitely an experience that I suggest everyone to have. The students are taught the proper ways to travel and operate around lava. They have to bring a lot of water to prevent dehydration and dress properly. They have um, boots that won't melt when they walk on hot surfaces and that they have clothing that won't melt. <laughs> You could accidentally walk into a lava flow if you are not paying attention, as a slow-moving flow can easily blend into the landscape. Whatever the speed, it is extremely hot and can be very dangerous. Go stand up and you can kind of like scan. Try to teach them how to collect good data and to do it in a safe way. The work begins as soon as the class arrives. Well, we're out here just taking a few samples, getting some temperature readings, mapping the flow. We can go out in the field and actually learn about and learn the field methods. And the fact that we get to come out here in the lava is pretty awesome. We can read about things in the book. We can do math equations and stuff like that. But then it really sets it off for people when they can actually come out and see all of that happen in front of their eyes. The students learn the different properties of lava and how to determine if it is fast or slow moving and a threat. They also take turns wearing a special protective suit for experiments, like measuring the lava's temperature. A once-in-a-lifetime experience for most, a much more common occurrence for UH Hilo students. It's great. It's, it's hard, to, hard to describe. You get to see Earth being created. You can't do that many other places.